Hi, lovely people of YouTube. Ella Ham. I am in Gemi Trattoria, Tambridge Wells. It is incredible, so beautiful. The food is unbelievable. And what I'm going to make today, fantastic seafood pasta with cockles, mussels, and prawn. It's so delicious, so simple, it's unbelievable. First of all, we need olive oil, crushed garlic, cockles, and mussels, splash of wine, cover, and let you open. Wow, wow, look at that. Let me cool down just a little bit. In a bowl, just remove it, the cockles, and the mussels of the shells, strain it, the juice, the lovely flavor, and put them on the side. Beautiful, look at these prawns, they're so beautiful. Remove the shells, remove the head, remove the little intestine which you have them inside, slice them in half, put them on the side. Now, let's start to cook it. You need one clove of garlic, slices, big one, small one, doesn't matter, any side. Quarter of a chili, this is quite a large one, my God. Make sure the chili is good. Slice it. Three or four tomato, which cut them in half. Make sure the tomato is quite ripe. So just roughly cut it. That should be enough. That should be enough. You need an handful of parsley leaves, just roughly chop. Plus, I got two handful of a freshy piece. Use some very good olive oil. Look, a Abundance, the word abundance, abundance is a lot because many people comment what, what abundance is. Is my, my accent, abundance, lots of olive oil. Garlic and chili, straight in. I'm gonna get the tomato now. That's good. From straight in. If the garlic goes brown a little bit, not to worry. It's about 100 gram, 150 gram of a fresh spaghetti, but you can use some different pasta. Also linguine. Oh yes, oh yeah, look at that. I want them with this pasta al dente. So the pasta is ready. A little bit of a pasta water. The pasta goes straight in and start to mix it. Here we got lovely salt. Just a little touch of salt. Just put everything inside. Oh my gosh, look at that. Just a little touch of a parsley. Yeah, this is done. But it's not finished yet. I've got this fantastic homemade fresh bread crumb, which I put in some rosemary, some parsley, little touch of garlic, and just look at that. We call them a Renata, almost like a sand when you go on the beach. So don't forget, this is the seafood pasta. Now, where's the beach? Is the beach, is the breadcrumbs, is the sand. Oh, yes. I can't wait to taste it. Little drizzle of olive oil, little squeeze of lemon. And this is seafood pasta with the prawn, cocos, mussels, and fresh peas. It is so delicious. Please do cooking. You can use just prawn or just mussels. Let's enjoy. Don't forget to comment on the comment box. Where is he? Here, the comment box. Where is the comment box? Here. Where? Somebody stole the comment box. I only joke. Just comment box here on below. And tell me which way you want me to cook some seafood pasta, and I will do it for you. And tell me what you want me to cook for you, and I will do it for you. Let's enjoy it together. Let's love the food all together. And from Trattoria in Gem Italian, and a big arrivederci. I wish you could always smell it. I love you all. Mm, 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 mm.